Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil, where we last left off. Uh, we cleared up a few loose ends. Now, we basically have this to do, which is fine, because we don't need to have Rebecca waiting around for us anymore. Because uh, we've used all of our healing abilities, which is cool. So we need to go do the emblem. And what else do we need to do? We need to go fight Yawn, which is going to be a pain in the balls. And Chris, if you could get around there, that'd be fantastic. Thank you, buddy. Uh, and then we can get the last key. Then we can get the last bit, the emblem. Then we can get out of here and start making our way to the guardhouse which is where things are going to get a little bit more interesting uh ammo wise we're not bad it certainly could be worse we've got two magazines Ooh, two magazines i was thinking you're fighting yawn uh oh we're not really gonna fight yawn we're gonna um snatch and grab fighting yawn the second time that's going to be a problem now the fact that we don't have the grenade launcher as, as, as Chris is also another bit of a fuck factor I mean I I thought we got more magnum rounds as Chris and maybe we do uh, you know maybe we do but it's not seeming like it yet Um, and I can't tell if, as of yet, we have more shotgun shells. Ah, oh, you dick penis man. The trouble is, fighting the hunters. The hunters that eat shotgun shells for frickin' breakfast, man. Like, really, why are you turning around? You are dumber than I gave you credit for, sir. Right, okay, he should be path to us now. Um, yeah, so shotgun shells, they eat them. Literally, what does this say? You can't actually examine that. They eat them. They're like yum, yum, yummy in my tummy. Little bastards. I've seen uh, these guys take five shotgun shells. Five shotgun shells. Yes, right? Five shotgun shells. That is redonkulous, and I could have gone and did this a more efficient route, actually, but it doesn't matter. So, almost a whole pack of shotgun shells just for a hunter. And also, the hunt, the shotgun doesn't really hit stun them that much. Not as much as it should, because they're bastards. So, fighting the hunters is... is mm, I think we're going to run past the hunters where we can. Uh, which is a good few hunters we can avoid. There are going to be some that we're going to have to tactically remove. Tactically. Right. Now, so I think what we've got to do is we have to get Rebecca to have a fiddle in here. Um, and while she's fiddling around in here, we can go fight Yawn. I think. Yeah. No, we can't fight Yawn. I... Because we haven't got the key. Right, let's give this a go. Chris, unfortunately, can't read music. You fool. That was Chris, just give it up. <laughs> it's me, Chris. Yeah, uh, is that you? Yeah. Oh, God, good God. It's the Moonlight Sonata. Can you play?
Wait, what is <laughs> that? It was better than yours, Chris. My interpretation is off a little. Chris, may I practice for a while? Uh, I don't really know why you're asking my permission, but... Sure. See? Just relax and play. All right. Not sure this is the right time to be doing this, of course. Um, yes. Chris could be a little bit more encouraging, to be fair. Now, Rebecca can do everything poorly. She can play basketball, because we've seen the photo in Resident Evil 2. She can uh, heal people. And she's pretty good at that, actually. She can repair helicopters poorly. She can play the piano poorly. She can spray chemicals in our face adequately. She's She is a jack of all trades, really. And I actually really, really like her as a character. Resident Evil Zero was a good game. Um, it wasn't perfect. It did a few new things that I don't think I liked very much, especially the lack of item boxes. Um, but the trouble is, it totally, totally breaks the, um, the canon. Because she's this rookie noob character who's pretty bloody useless. Um, you know, she's a young kid, essentially. She's basically an intern, although she's not an intern. Um, I'm hoping if I just run around here and do the loop, she'll be ready to go. But if you play through Zero, she's actually a fucking badass. And she's easily on par with Chris and uh, Jill and the others. Easily up there with those guys. But the trouble is they never really mention it. Like, there's no foundation in this game for it. Obviously, because this was the original. I guess they didn't have a grand plan for this game back then. But it's so strange, you know? And I don't think they've really written that into um, into the remake either. Uh, I can't remember too much about the story of the remakes. We haven't played it for a while. That's obviously going to change. But you know what I mean. Okay. Um... Did we go in both of these rooms? I we did, we did. So we can't fight you on yet. Uh, we can't snatch and grab from you on yet. Can't do either of those rooms yet. Yeah, so I think now we just need to play the waiting game. Wait for her to kind of get up to speed. She's a little bit strange, but I suppose we can have a lap around the mansion. I guess. It's kind of nothing else we can really do whilst we wait. I don't know if we actually sit there and wait if she will get better on her own. I know in the remake, there is... Um, there is an event I think you have to trigger. Again, I might be talking out of my bum. Uh, we could go out there, I suppose, and put the emblems in the hole, but there's not a lot of point, really, is there? <sighs> I think it is just a time trigger. And if it isn't, I don't know what we can do. Because the only thing we need is to go fight, or go rob off Yawn. But Yawn has... Uh, his his door is locked. So, hmm. Now, I was always confused about this. I really used to think there was something under here. I can't believe there's nothing under this one. I could have sworn there was. I don't know. I don't know, Chief.
Right, well, there's no point going in there because it's just ink ribbons. We don't need the ink ribbons. And there's two zombies in there on the floor in this mode. And we don't really want to spend the ammo on them, to be honest. This area is tagged, completely empty. I don't know if, if we open these doors, does that let dogs in here? Hey, buddy. I guess it doesn't. It's too dangerous to go outside. Too dangerous to go outside. I believe in the remake, if you do that, um, you get three dogs or two dogs break in. Which was really cool. Alright. I'm definitely not going to be doing uh, three concurrent uh, LPs at the same time <laughs> again. Because, yeah, it, it's yeah, recording three different games at once. It's kind of a bit difficult, actually. I thought I could handle it, you know. I really... There, she's got it. She's got it. Yeah, you just have to do a lap around the mansion. Um, I like the way you can hear her from outside here as well. It's really cool. Chris, Chris. I'm glad they can take time in all this terror to have a bit of fun. You like it? I love it, Rebecca. It's fantastic. Let's go get a drink. <laughs> Look at him. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fine. Fine work, Rebecca. If only Wesker was here. But I don't think I don't think Wesker likes you, Rebecca. I hope he doesn't shoot oh, you. Oh, that end. was great. <laughs> uh, why is my phone going off? What is that? It's a door, Rebecca. Of the secret kind. Don't worry. I had anticipated this with my detective intuition. Will you take the gold emblem? I... We certainly will. It's the hollow the emblem was in. It was. You're fucking fantastic at this, Chris. Put that one back in. What? I see. Like, I'm even getting confused. Uh, which one goes where? I do do. Yes. Right. Well, at least um, we can admire the window there, where the dead plants are. This is like some sort of viewing room where they was uh, overlooking the plant room. So I guess they were. Th there's an experiment going on in there. I'm not sure. She just. Chris, are you all right? I think so. Uh, yes, Rebecca, I'm fine. So what? You keep staring at the wall over there, and uh, we're gonna go do something. We're gonna go put this emblem in. Why do these characters never join up and and, and walk around together? Apart from the very brief. Um, interactions with Jill and, and Barry and I mean very brief let's split up uh, why you have zombies monsters oh my and you're gonna split up and go around individually <sighs> honestly oh that sound is so haunting mrs. wants to get a grandfather clock and I'm like ooh. Ooh, can we hide stuff behind it? Oh, that's not a key. Oh, no, that's the blue gem, wasn't it? Yes, and the blue gem gets us the key, question mark? Well, that's got me stumped. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Get the, the key from here. From the tiger. I wonder if Rebecca's still in that room. Should we go have a little look? Is she just in there, staring at the door, trying to work it out? What is this? Would have been nice to have a little bit more action with Bazza. No, she's gone. 
That's fine. She's not got herself locked in there, is she? No. Nope. Okay. That's fine. Ooh. At least it's impossible to get locked in this room because you're always in there with the key. So that's interesting. Let's get out of here. Hmm. Now the guy that built this mansion, I can't remember his name, something Trevor. I remember his daughter's name, Lisa Trevor, which was a really fucking horror, horrific, uh, why am I going back here? Horrifically cruel uh, storyline that they added into the, the, the remake. Um, they did actually tie him into Resident Evil 7. There is a log that you can read in Resident Evil 7, and he built some of the uh, house <laughs> in Resident Evil 7. Which is why there's so many weird, creepy turns and hallways and stuff, which is really strange. Uh, and kind of a, a kind of a cheap way to tie it all in, but... Uh, I guess they were clutching at straws to try and tie Resident Evil 7 into the universe. And there is our key. A key that only has one door. And it's a door that I don't like. Uh, if you want my honest opinion. I don't like this door. You can't make me like it. I am not going to enjoy this. And I'm going to save it. I'm going to put down a safety save as my, my buddy Jimmy would say. We're going to have a safety save. Because... Holy shit balls. I know just how quick yawn can wreck the day. Um Let's go back to the other save room. I don't want to fight yawn. There's no point. It's just a waste of ammo. On easier diff well, that's I don't know. That's not true because with Jill we had so much freaking ammo towards the end of the game. It was silly. I don't think we're going to have that with Chris. I really don't. Um, um, we've already felt the ammo pinch with Chris. Which we didn't get with Jill from what I can remember. We could just go straight up there and do yawn now. But I really want to put down that safety save. Because if I die here, that's going to be quite painful. Uh, I also need to write on this memory card later. This is my Resident Evil 1 memory card. And then I can keep these saves forever. Well, you know, until the memory card gets old and corrupted and doesn't work anymore. Which... I don't know if that's a thing, to be honest. I don't know how reliable these memory cards are. That's why I always buy the Sony ones. I have had a memory card go bad. Uh, a PlayStation 1 memory card, and I think it was a Logic 3 one. Uh, it just says it needs to be formatted, and you format it a thousand times, nothing happens. Which is why I like... Um, only buying the official ones. They cost a little bit more money. They're a little bit harder to find. But how much money would you want to put on your saves, you know? Right, let's put down a safety save. Because I don't really want to do all this again. Are we going to need to? Should we just say Fuck it. No, because I don't have time. I'm back to work soon. I don't have time to keep redoing everything all over again. Um, ink ribbons. Ink ribbons. There is no penalty for saving this game either, so. There we go. Memory card one. I actually have a uh, almost brand new PlayStation 1 memory card. Complete in box and everything. Oh, that's one of the most cherished things in my collection. Because just to have it complete in box. C 
because I haven't seen one of those boxes since I was like eight years old. And when I saw it, I was like, bid, 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 bid. And I actually got it at a really cheap price as well. I, ooh, did I? I can't remember. Might have been one of those things that you, you don't want to admit how much you paid for. You paid that for what? A fucking memory card? Yes. <laughs> yes. I do like my collectibles though. I'm trying to get a PlayStation 2 complete in box at the moment. I've got my Wii U complete in box. Xbox One X is obviously a box. PS4. <gasps> I threw the box out for my PS4 Pro. Oh, when I moved. I'm going to regret that. I'm going to regret that. I might wait until the PS4 Pro becomes dirt cheap in three or four years. And pick one up second hand. And can we talk about the prices of consoles? PlayStation 2s are now fetching like a hundred pounds for a f fucking PlayStation 2. They're literally building bloody roads out of them. There's so many of them around. They're common. A hundred quid. We use a couple of months ago. We use was about 60, 70 quid. A hundred and eighty pounds now. And my friend gave me one for. Um, Oh god, here we go. My friend gave me one for my birthday. Last year or the year before. He's actually uh the he actually runs um a Facebook group called We Users and it's like one of the biggest We U groups on Facebook. And he gave me one and they're so expensive now. But the Wii U's such a cool underrated system as well. Uh right, let's go. Yes, hello Yawn. Nice to meet you, bud. I'm not going to be here too long. Yes, I'm sure your breath is fragrant as ever. Oh, fucking hell. I never know the best way to avoid this guy. I guess I could... Oh, pick up Chris. Grab the fucking shells, you bastard. Run, 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 run. Ooh, yep, that's going to hurt. That's going to hurt big time. Grab the crest. We're poisoned, but we're okay. All right. So much health as Chris, it's silly. Run, run, please. Yes. Ooh. What were you going to go, Yawn? Yeah, you got nothing. Oh, my God. We didn't even need the safety save, guys. We didn't even need it. We didn't even need it. We didn't need We, we, we didn't even need it. Didn't, didn't need it at all. Now, is Rebecca going to save us? We just been bitten by a fucking great big snake. So, yeah, I guess we're going to get saved. <laughs> I was like, um, or not, <laughs> maybe. Oof, PlayStation, you left me hanging there. Um, yeah, I need to collect more consoles. I love collecting consoles. Complete and box. Hmm. Yes. Chris, are you all right? Uh, yeah. W what happened? You were bitten by a poisonous snake. Are you okay? Ah, uh, my head is killing me. I think you'll be all right because I gave you a shot. But please stay out of trouble. Shot sure of what? He doesn't specify. You saved my life. I owe you one. Thanks, Rebecca. She doesn't clarify what she gave us. Chris, take care. Don't go doing anything reckless like tangling with danger noodles. Got ya. Okay, uh, so we now have all the crests. That went really quite well. Uh, I would have liked to have not get bitten, but let's not get greedy now. Um, I actually thought we was going to make it out at one point. Right, so let's get all the crests. Uh, let's get our shotgun shells all together. Do we need the shotgun shells? Do we want to? 
we've got 28 that's 35 that's 42 shotgun shells we have that that sounds like a lot but with the hunters it really fucking isn't I think I would rather try and save the shotgun shells until we've uh, we've at least come back to the mansion. I mean, by the time we come back to the mansion, we have to switch up to the shotgun. We have no choice. But, hmm. Let's put that back. 35 shotgun shells. That is rather nice. I'm not going to lie. And now, we're, oh, we're ready to go outside, but we don't really have the ammo to go outside. I mean, we do, because we don't, you know, have to fight the dogs, but, oh, fuck. Yeah, there's a lot of dogs outside. Yeah, there's a lot of, fuck off, fuck off. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, there's a lot of dogs outside. Like, um, there's two, three, uh, we're going to have to take the shotgun because I want to harvest up all the herbs. So, we're going to have to take the shotgun. Or do we take the magnum? Have I just sworn by saying we're going to take the magnum to use on dogs? Ah, uh, shit, I don't know. I don't know the best thing to do here, guys. I really don't. Hmm. I mean, um, we've got so we can hold so few herbs as well. Like, so few herbs. Mm. Chris is this big, tough, strong, powerful man, but he has the carrying capacity of, I don't know, some sort of schoolgirl thing, I guess. Ugh. Right. Mm. I guess when you fit that much chiseled ass into a pair of pants, you can't fit uh, a lot of equipment. And that could really be taken the wrong way as well. What kind of equipment are you packing, Chris? Oh, let's not go there. Ah, head out of the gutter. Hmm. Right. Come on, Chris. Chris. Complete global saturation, Chris. Let's think about this. Uh, I really don't want to be wasting the shotgun on dogs. Because if we waste too much ammo, we're going to get ourselves into a situation where we're just destination fucked. I don't even want to put down a safety save. I do want to get some blue herbs. Just to have a couple in the... Well, we might as well grab them all. I suppose. I can't do it, guys. I can't leave. I can't leave stuff. I can't. I, I, That's why I can't speedrun. Because I see items and I have to have them. Now... How many dogs have we got here? We've got two, haven't we? Yeah, we've got the two. Let's just... We're going to pay for this. I know we are. We're going to fucking pay for this. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I know. Now, if we're... S yes, I know that. I actually want that as a tattoo. Oof. Oof. It's going to hurt. Yep, it's going to hurt. Ouch. That is going to hurt. Oh, that might mm, that might make a nice back tattoo, actually. Maybe. So we're going to have to put down the dogs out here. Oh, we've got to pick up this crank as well. Mm. Oh, man. Destination fucked. Uh, right. Well, there's not a lot we can do about that at the moment, I suppose. Uh, I can't leave the herbs, especially on this difficulty. 
I mean, the thing is, like, if I leave, I, I got Collector Mania. Is it called Collector Mania? Maybe not in real life, but in games, I have it really bad. Hmm. Although things, I, I'm a sucker for memory cards. Yeah, even as a kid. Oh, here we go. Even as a kid, I could not own enough memory cards. I would have more memory cards than games. Uh, if I could, I didn't. I only had, like, I think I had two. Um, and I think I had one Dreamcast memory card. And Dreamcast memory cards were a bit rubbish for capacity. Some games damn near filled them up in one go. Um, right. I mean, okay. So we can take most of these herbs. Most of these herbs. In fact, we can take all of these herbs, apart from the blue ones. Yeah, we can. Uh, do we want to shoot these dogs? I mean, there's dogs here when we come back anyway. So, yep, ouch, ouch. Yep, these dogs do... Like, if we kill these dogs, there will be more dogs when we come back. So I'm not convinced shooting these dogs is actually worth it. Dogs in the main courtyard. There's nothing really out there. Yeah, there's nothing really out in the main courtyard for us to worry about. And I think once we make our return journey, when the hunters are about to get unleashed, I'm pretty sure all these dogs outside disappear apart from the ones that we just run past. I think... This is all guesswork on this difficulty. All guesswork. The water is running down the opposite side. Yes, Chris. Believe it or not, buddy, Chris. We've done this a lot, mate. Between, you know, not for a long time. But there was a time, Chris, where I'm pretty sure I might have been with your partner, Jill. But we used to run this a lot. Uh Okay. Now, I've also been asked about Parasite Eve as well. Uh, yes, Parasite Eve is a game that I've always wanted to do. Because I never completed it as a kid. I played a lot of it as a kid. It was like the cool kid that always had it. Um, and I always wanted to uh, play it and own it and complete it myself. But I never did. Right, okay, these dogs are actually fairly easy to avoid, and I don't think they have anything. These dogs out here, we are going to have to put down. Oof, because there is herbage here. Although only... Yeah, we, we need blue herbs in our inventory. We need blue herbs in our inventory. Because of this area. One down. He's around that corner. There he comes. Shit, stop firing early. Come on. Oh, God. Okay. Last magazine. Come on. Don't be greedy now. You greedy bastard. Alright. Oh, don't go back out there. Chris! Chris! You fool! Don't go back out there, Chris. Okay. I'm hoping the time, my end time on this as well, is going to be a lot more accurate because I have been saving. Uh, obviously, I save at the end of every video because I kind of have to uh, from paranoia. 
<laughs> of anything going wrong because you know this 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 PlayStation 2 here seems to be really good. It's my limited edition like silver fat boy. But I wouldn't trust any of my old consoles really like that. So I do save it whenever I finish a recording. Um because my PlayStation 2 slim now is totally and utterly dead for PlayStation 1 games. Plays uh, DVDs, uh, DVD based games, so like PlayStation 2 games, plays them just fine. But that's obviously because the PlayStation 2s have two lasers, I believe. They've got a CD laser and they have a uh, DVD laser. As the majority of dual format machines do. Um, so it just seems to be the, the, the CD laser that's dead on it. But this PlayStation 2 is fairly reliable. But what I've been doing is I will save the game at the end of the video. And then I shall reset my machine or my console. So I'm hoping, unless I get interrupted halfway through a video, which does happen, I'm hoping um, our end time will be more uh, closer to what it should be. Might be a few minutes here or there that we, we could have cut down on, but should more or less be there. Um, right, so. We have so much health. We have so much health. Now, we know. We know this will change. We know this will change. As soon as hunters... Cause I know the Hunters are going to be way harder with press Because, I mean, the grenade launcher with Jill is pretty baller. It really does a good job. At killing uh, enemies. Uh, especially the fact that you could fire it so fast. You really could double tap that motherfucker. But not so much uh, anything we have with Chris can we double tap um, let's put an FA spray we had more FA sprays with with Jill as well we had like two at this point I think definitely oh fuck I thought that was some gorilla looking motherfucker right there I was like oh what the hell I don't understand these uh, holes either lel I don't understand if all of them have tentacles in, or, 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 or what the deal is with that. Very tempted to run all the freaking way back now to try and grab up those herbs, those few blue herbs that we had left there. I don't think that's going to be wise, because I don't think we're going to need them. But. Oof, I don't know. Alright, let's have these. Okay. Hmm. Now, what to do next? Should I go check out the spider room first? Doesn't seem like a bad idea in my head. I do have my books. Oh, look at this. Look what I've got on my desk. I've got Days Gone uh, on the PS4, and I have Project Zero. Okay. <laughs> Ironically, a PlayStation 2 game and a PlayStation 4 game uh, sat next to my Xbox One X. I don't think backwards compatibility is ever going to get that good. But you never know. Right. Um, mm -mm -mm. Let's open my book. Let's find a page. And we shall call it. Uh, let's find a blank page. Right. Resident Evil. Let's go for Resident Evil Director's Cut Chris Arrange Mode. Res Evil D C Chris. Um now I want to have a little look. Now what I love about this pen is you can, uh, yeah, look, there's no tentacle there. What I love about this pen is it's got a rubber <laughs> on the end, and you can rub this pen out. It's fucking sorcery. Right, let's grab that. We shall take the red book. 
Let's get out so we can reset the spinners. I'm going to go back in and we're going to check the password for the V-Jolt door. Why is there no tentacle? Is it okay? So do they just fuck you over by adding extra holes? I don't know. And there's nothing else in this. Oh shit! The spiders are out. Ah bollocks. Wait, is there three spiders on this mode? It looks like it. It looks like a clock dial. Two fifteen. So that is different to what we had last time, which was nine forty-five or nine fifteen. Uh, v. Jolt room. Code. Two fifteen. Now, I could, you know, I've got a guide for this game anyway, the official guide, but I don't want to dig it out. Um, some kind of code. Yes, it is, Chris. Now, I do like uh, keeping notes and stuff on physical paper with pen. There's, I don't know why. I think, again, it comes back to childhood goodness. So, let's go and save it. I feel like such a tool for putting down that danger save. I really do. But I know if I didn't do that, I would have been killed. But Chris is definitely, definitely significantly tougher. Uh, also, another cool dude on YouTube. Um, blind man. Is saying that he wants to rerun Resident Evil 1 as well on his channel. So, I might, I, I'm going to link his channel in this video. Fuck, i got to remember that now. Um, so check that out as well. If you like your Resident Evil 1 Let's Plays, you know, he's a pretty cool dude. He does some good shit. So, exciting. Always happy to spread the Resident Evil. The Resident Evil vibe. And I've still got the Resident Evil uh, DLC that me and uh, Jimmy did ages ago. Resident Evil 5 DLC uh, to render and upload. So you will probably do once this game is finished. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, when we come back, uh, we're going to continue opening some more doors. And I'm going to consider going back to grabbing those herbs. No. No. Don't, 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 don't do it. It's not worth it. We can grab them on the way back. So till then, guys, thanks for watching.